Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to our Bhutan playthrough. You need your four with me, your host, Lucky Marine. You have... Is Venice still a thing? It is. It's been pushed off actual Venice by an Austria. Bohemia's got big. Salzburg's big for what they usually are. Brandenburg's just... Brandenburg thinks that it's Sweden. It probably will end up being Sweden at some point. Great Britain is racked by rebels. British noble rebels, alright. Scotland is a thing. They didn't move their capital back here, which is good. It allows them more expansion over here. I'd like to know who this is. Castilian Louisiana. I know Castilian Louisiana. I'd like to know what this is. Good. Balmanis announced us as a rival. What? Fine. Don't care. And we have diplomats. Let's... If we were to declare war upon you, how many people would that drag in? Tax Kalia. Zapotec. Let's go for the head of the beast, shall we? We can't. Well, who has the highest dev provinces that we have access to? That's really loud in my ear holes. Let's declare war on Zapotec. Brings in Tlapanek. However, oh, we already have. We're out of claim on you. Oh, we could fight them on the way down, I suppose. Do we? Do we, though? Let's make you a core because you're given us other extension. Yeah, let's take this guy out. Whilst we're here. Turn your fort on and turn your fort on in order to uh, contain them just a little bit. Let's go to full maintenance and let's go. Okay. Okay. And a conversion. Excellent. Next. Go. Make hay whilst the sun is most definitely and certainly shining. Aztec, let's... Oh, we need to... So many subjects. Build spy network on you so we can fabricate on your stuff around you. We will... We'll snap our network on French Brazil. Or get one started at least so we can get through his capital fort just a little bit quicker. And we'll leave a diplomat free because it takes a million years to get from point A. But for our diplomats to get around the world. Who more tech? There we go. Done. Let's go. Fair wall. Take that. You take them out. You take them out. And everyone's happy. Everyone is happy. See? See the happy smiles? Happy smiling faces on all of their faces there. Portugal is considering attacking. Hurry up. Don't care. Don't even know where Hadia is. No, I can't be that. No. Must be some primitives over here that we haven't found yet, so they're not on the list. any cannons you do let's snaffle your cannons along with someone with a pip 
trick them on that. We'll get you four ready to step off. Okay. You got cannons? You do. You fancy lending them for the good of siege? Excellent. And what do we want from this fight? All of this. You know in certain terms. We've got a separate PC out to you because you're a subject nation. There we go. Quick and easy. That gives us 45% overextension, 76 aggressive expansion. Who is it going to be with? English Mexico, who we already have a truce with, Zapotec, Tascaran, Saxcala, English West Indies, already have a truce with them, I think. No, we don't. And Norway. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Get rid of that. Return calls, no. Cancel subjects, no. Release nations, no, no, no. Whatever money you've managed to accrue, goodbye. And hello, Bhutan, South America. Our font is growing. I mean, this font isn't. This font's going to be the same font forever. <gasps> oh, Britain. First, Hawaii. I don't know why they took Hawaii. I don't know how they had access to Hawaii. How could you get to Hawaii from there? I don't know. Anyway, let's get that stuff called the stuff that's given us overextension. Anything that's at zero, I'm willing to leave until we've got 25% co-creation cost and our leader dies. Anything that's going to give us overextension though, not so much. We'll get that converted away. Cord away, even. Fort, let's keep you down. Do we just wait here? Caddo. Caddo. It is a native. Although doesn't Caddo have amazing ideas? Idea cost minus 10%, national unrest minus 2, production efficiency, stability cost modifier, morale of armies plus 10, yeah that's good. Manpower recovery speed plus 15. Yeah, quite good. Allied with Quite a few people, that's probably why they've kept them, or what, how they've kept themselves safe. But that's fine. That's fine. Whilst we're here, we might as well group up and drill. Caddo have insulted us. I, have you not seen what has happened to everybody before us? English Mexican separatists. Let's have you heading back up towards English Mexican separatists of which they're going to be 30,000 all right let's all go there I knew there was a reason why I was stalling around here once we put them down once they'll probably never rise up again in that time the separatism will have entirely disappeared Two base production internet. Really? All the productions, all the production bonuses that we're getting internet. Excellent. The 22 dev province. Ridiculous. Um, she must publicly denounce her old faith. Uh, yeah, let's do this one. It makes it easier to convert it out. Dissemination of the coffee plant. For centuries, coffee has been a product exclusively grown and exported from Yemen and Ethiopia. In fact, the merchants of Yemen in particular... In fact, the merchants of Yemen in particular has had such a strong grip... Have. Have, not has. Have had such a strong grip of the coffee trade. Who reads these? Who reads these? And decides this is... A, yeah, this is English. 
Probably Swedish person. Yeah, fair one. Yeah, alright, okay. Moving swiftly on. Coffee trade, they've gone to great lengths to stop anyone from bringing the plants across their borders. Just as the silkworm once travelled west along the trade routes, so too has the coffee plant come to be in possession of our merchants. The plant... The plantages... The plantages in Kawasqua have begun to produce coffee in no small amounts and the beans are now much more readily available. Well, that's capitalism for you, isn't it? Oh, I didn't even read the tooltip. Balls. Probably, uh, if I was to guess, the price of coffee going down. I didn't realise it was going to be a tooltip. I just thought it was one of those that you clicked off. Anyway, you're done. You are. Let's have you protecting trade in the Molucas. Let's have you mothball because you're not needed at the moment in time. Let's have you drilling because why not? Colony is self-sustaining. That's not a colony. Excellent. Now we want to leave a little bit of a gap so that French Brazil can uh, can get amongst this area and uh, and gobble it up for us, and we can just steal it off him. So let's just fill in some gaps, shall we? And where did you pop? Yeah, we've got enough people walking up there. I could do with a fort up here, I think. Extra 10 years of separatism, that's unfortunate. Do I have the right person in charge here? This is probably a river crossing, but I can't risk him going elsewhere. Again, I can't risk you spreading your dirty separatism to Irish, so we're going to charge you down straight away, and you can meet us. Extra 10 years of, of separatism in two provinces is not bad. In three, eh. No. Excellent. Let's have... Let's do a split down the middle of both of those armies. And we'll get you converted out. Also a fort right here would be nice. Do we have any defensive terrain? Yeah, we have woods. So you have <clears throat> 13 separatism, but you also have recent uprising. In that time, religious unity, no, no. Discontent, no, that's probably always going to be a thing. Overextension, eee, that'll come down. Separatism will come down. Yeah, by the time recent uprising burns itself off, this should be fairly stable. Do we have any more? Castilian, Brazilian. Pawnee separatists in Irish. Now once it's called, they'll be fine. They'll be fine. Might as well drill if you just do nothing. We can make states. Not just yet. What am I doing with my money? Uh, we don't really need a trade fleet just because we're in a weird position. Miltech cost minus 10%. Nice. Right, let's get the claim on one of these. 8 dev, 12 dev, 7, 7, 3, 15. Alright, claim your capital. Now 
That brings in Tarascan and Laxacala. Plus everyone else, I think. How close are we? And how much does it go by? Let's have a little look. Every month that we're drilling, it goes up by the tiniest of amounts. Are you drilling as well? You are. Is that a fresh colony? It is. It's exactly what we want. French Brazil to expand this way and we'll eat him from this end. It means that a lot of this land is going to be French culture, but we may inevitably uh, end up accepting it. We will see. Let's eat the gooey middle. You stop training down that way. You stop training. And I want you on the north side. Let's turn you on. In fact, turn this guy on. Let's come in from the side. Turning you on isn't going to do much. They'll probably still be able to get past you. We have no fault up here. All right. Build plantations. Excellent. Next. Create proper fleet. Conquer a die. It's given us a CB against Creek. Oh, this is Creek. I assumed that this was France. Okay, well we'll do this, and then we'll do Creek. Hunter population, excellent. Uh oh. Corporation cost minus twenty five percent. What is it at the moment? In terms of costs. Uh. Most expensive ones around 65. Let's grab you. Brings it down to 49. Now we have so many things to call that will have made a big impact. That will saved us a lot of points. And let's put someone in this seat. Yield inflation reduction, yield prestige. We might as well put the inflation reduction guy in. I doubt from the estate we can grab. No, not until 73. It's going to be quite a while away. But we can at the very least be arresting this increase in inflation. And it's an extra couple of points. It's an extra point. Extra admin point. What could we get here? Colonial range, don't need it. So the plan, eliminate, stack, sweep through, whilst you try and uncover whatever this is here. Declare war for Mexico, Tarascan. If we were to declare war on you, well, we might as well make you a co belligerent. Squish. Damn you, stupid horses. Next. Off you go. How many do we need here? Just the nine. Let's split off five. Yep. 
and the rest. Move out a little bit. Should be a squish there. It was. Excellent. Let's split you evenly between those two forts. How many do you need? Three. Which means you lot can move on. You need six. I'll keep a few here, I think. No. Send three on. Intricate web weaver. It's alright. Not brilliant. Okay. Excellent. Next. Yeah, they, they might run a mock down here, but. I'll be taking faults. And it's faults that count. It's always faults that count. Move you on and you on. One that siege, which means I cannot squish you, but I can move on to that capital without a leader. That was silly of me. But we are quite good at fighting. Fall of Kyoto, did I just see? On that siege, there, good. So, Japan is a thing. Good day, Japan. Tributary of Ming. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Did it the stupid way. Japan did it the easy way. You don't tributize your way to Ming. Good. Let's have you two moving on. Can we get all the way around? We can. One of you take that back. That's pretty much it. That is pretty much it. Three dev, three. What about down here? Should concentrate colonies down here. One, two, three. Oh, I've already got three on the go. Of course, you're the one that we took from England. That we had to guard. Okay, okay. What are you? Cannons. Let's lend you to a siege. Let's take some of the infantry away. Somebody's just popped in the middle of that. I have no idea what it is. Just broken away. Can we go find it? No, I don't think we're... Right. Are we at war with it? I don't think we are. No. Cannons, jump on that. Yeah, it's just pure infantry. No wonder they're struggling. You have cannons as well. Let's land you in there. So what has popped here? Who is it? That will be at war with them. There we are. Who is it? Tarascan. Okay. Interesting. The sack of such and such a place. Gain 5 army professionalism. Lose all the ducats. Gain 50 devastation in Mexico. Come on. It'll take down. 
There we go. Done. Tarascan. Now if I do it via the wall leader, I can take all the things. I believe. No. No. Tarascan. Let's separately piece you out for that. You are co-belligerent. Warps, why not? Money, why not? Fine. Now. Sax Carlo in 98 days. Yeah, I'd love to speak to you. I know I've just been at this table with you all, but it's going to take me 98 days just to uh, tell the big G's what has gone on here. Give you code now. I I don't care what's going on here. The bat the war is won, and they have uh, they have fanned about down it. I could do with a fort along this route actually, just to control movement north and south in the jungle with river crossings either side. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, Panama would be a great fort. In the jungle with roof crossing either side. I think I will build it after this. Okay. No matter what you do here, it's not going to undo this. Just stop. So, all of that plus that. Okay. Superb. And we have run out of admin point. Pay those corruptions down. One or more of your subjects has a high limit. What the fuck? How do we take on that? What? Um, can I just let you go? I, I no interest in having a vassal. Alright, five years. Or ten years or so. We'll be able to get rid of Aztecs. Damn it. Oh well. The majority of uh, Central of America's are ours. These will all make their way back up here. So we should really... Stand around this choke point. I also want to start a fort here. Yes. Aztecs, what are you doing? Squishing themselves, that's what happened. Alright, let's move you down this way to sweep out. I expected them all to start moving back towards their old capitals, but that's not been a thing. Are you the one with... Maneuver. There we go. Okay. Uh, 18 stack can stay around about here. Tulika. This is calling Tulika. No. It's ours, and it will always be ours. I don't care about the liberty desire. I don't care about your happiness. I'm going to cut you away as soon as I can, and then I'm going to squish you. Good. 
One base tax in turn it. Turn it is. Turn it is getting all the events. Come on, let's get these squished. There's only what eight of them. All in all. Another squish and another squish. On the way down to Tapuia. Have you grown yet? Nope. Still just the three provinces that were there before. At least with a fort in Panama we can stop the toing and throwing. We'll go to half maintenance and send you two that way. Whew. Okay, and that is going to be it for this episode, ladies and gentlemen. We have somehow, I don't know how, uh, picked up Aztec as a vassal, which was unfortunate. I really didn't want him. Uh, I'm torn between just cutting him loose. Although I suppose he's the one that has to deal with all that devastation for the sacking of Mexico. Which is nice. <clears throat> yeah, we'll uh, we'll cut him loose as soon as we can. And then eat him. Another gold province. Pony separatists. English West Indian is win what? English West Indian separatist. We've never been to the West Indies. How is this? Gomorrah's. Is that this? No, it's Trinidad. So how have... Where the hell is that? Gomeras. Why? <laughs> Why? Why does the why does the English West Indies think that Gomeras is belongs to them? And we could do it with heading up to yeah, you head north. Sit in Ayesh. We'll kick off with Creek. Bring all of them. What tech are they? Tech nineteen. Ooh. Super uber strong natives. No wonder they survived for so long. Comanche, Caddo, Cree. Yeah, we might need everybody up here. Um, plus extras. Tech 15, Tech 18, Creek, Tech 19. Hmm. Interesting. What space do we have for more people? We have about 20 extra. Yeah, get another 20 stack. We have about 20 heading down here. Got about 20 heading up to Ayish. Take out Tapua. Hmm. Aggressive expansion. No, it's fine. It's fine. Do we go for French Brazil now? No, we'll take out Tapio. Uh, we'll then... Scotland, what are you capable of? If we were to declare war upon you, who would rush to your aid? Only Tapua, which is interesting. Because Scotland has the heartland up here. This is where its capital is. So, in the next episode, I'm going to grab some ships. Grab an explorer, and we're going to explore up here. See what of Scotland we could snaffle off them. But that'll be next time. I've been Lincoln Marine. As always, you lot have been amazing. Join me next time for all of that good stuff. In terms of great powers, we are third. In terms of development, we are second. Good times. Let's have a look at tech. 
manufacturers. We stole some off uh, British Mexico. French Brazil stuff is spreading into us. Uh, when we take out Tapua, we'll get another couple of provinces that have manufacturers. And it spread because of uh, the manufactory that we built in Bunjilong. And on Senate as well, actually, I think. Yep. Cool. So, until next time, from Bhutan, do take care.